Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it is Saturday, so it's grocery haul day. I have a great haul for you, some amazing, amazing deals, setting ourselves up for a healthy week. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I upload a grocery haul every Saturday and five videos every single week. Check out the description box down below where you will find nutrition coaching. Highly recommend those personalized macros and calories that is what I myself calculated and followed to lose my 140 pounds, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for questions, accountability, or to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things, and come join our Facebook group. It's free, it's supportive, we would love to have you. So let me turn you around and let's check out this week's grocery haul. Here is my grocery haul for the week. I shopped at my local Kroger store, which is Fry's. For us, wow, did I score some really good deals. They're having some great sales this week, so I'll let you know what items are on sale and for what price. So let's jump in to the haul. So the first thing I picked up is some more rolled oats. This is the Simple Truth brand 100% whole grain rolled oats. I am flying through oats. I've been making all sorts of oat breakfast and snacks. It's just such a great source of fiber and whole grains. I do always buy my rolled oats organic because they are heavily sprayed with glycosol, which is the active ingredient in Roundup. So if you can try to buy your oats organic, I want to say these were $3.99. I did score some really good meat deals. So I got this huge pack of chicken breast, 3.19 pounds for $9. That is a fantastic deal. I'm actually going to divide this into two separate little baggies and throw them in my freezer. I'll use this for Lola's chicken and rice. And then I think we're going to do burgers tonight. I was going to have a salad night, but I think we'll do salad for lunch and we'll do burgers tonight because I got this huge pack, 10 burgers for $5 and 20 cents. Now these are 80, 20. So those are for Troy. And then they had their 93, seven ground Turkey burgers for $5. So I picked those up for me. And then I did need ground Turkey for a recipe. This was also $5, it's 93.7. I grabbed some peanut butter cookies in the bakery. These were $2 and then I grabbed these little scones. These are cranberry orange, these are $1.25. I really like these with a protein source for breakfast. They're only 100 calories and they give you all of the bakery vibes, which I'm definitely here for. And then Troy will, def will eat the peanut butter cookies. I also got some turkey pepperoni for me because I do wanna do a pizza night this week. I do have a crust in my freezer from Imperfect Foods, actually two crusts, so I'm gonna go Going to do a big pizza night. We'll make a couple different pizzas so we have lots of leftovers. The crackers, again, are on a killer deal. If you buy three of the family size boxes, so the big boxes, they're $3.49 a box. So you know Troy loves his meat, cheese, and crackers. We've been flying through the crackers. So I got some original Triscuits. I did get some reduced fat wheat thins for me and then just some original wheat thins for him. And again, the family size box, $3.00 and 49 cents. And then I did get Cheez-Its for me. I skipped a week and I missed my Cheez-Its. I love having these as a crunchy snack. These were two for four, so only $2 a box. So I got extra cheesy and then my favorite, which is extra toasty. I did pick up a couple gallons of 1% milk for Troy for the week. Some Simple Truth organic pizza sauce so that we can make those pizzas. Two little cans of enchilada sauce. I'm making enchiladas for my lunch meal prep. After the grocery haul, stay tuned for what's on my menu for dinners and meal prep. And I also needed two cans of white beans for my dessert meal prep. I know that sounds really weird, but we're making a dessert that uses beans. So you're gonna love seeing Monday's meal prep. All of their Sara Lee Art Artisno items were $1.99 a piece on digital coupon this week. So I did get the brioche buns for burger night. I probably won't even have a bun, but if I do, these are actually really good. And then I picked up two more loaves of Troy's favorite bread. I'm just going to throw these in the freezer. $1.99 a loaf is cheaper than I can get them at Costco and Sam's Club. So I picked up two loaves. I also got some aluminum foil because I'm completely out and some reduced fat feta for my meal prep. I also love feta in eggs, omelets, salads. That is just a really good low calorie, low fat cheese. And I even got the reduced fat. So even less calories and less fat. I did get a couple different kinds of peanut butter. I got creamy peanut butter that's just peanuts and salt. I wanted a healthier option than Skippy, which is what we have on hand for Troy. So I got the creamy, and then I did get the creamy with honey, just in case I wanted to put it on celery or something where I wanted it with a little bit of sweetness. My favorite dark chocolate hummus from the brand Lantana was on sale for $2.25. This is so good, absolutely delicious. Actually, all of this brand's hummus are really good. They had dill pickle hummus redone 
reduced and I almost got it, but I still have some roasted red pepper hummus in my fridge from Whole Foods that I want to finish up. But I love this for dessert. I have those graham crackers that I bought at Trader Joe's last week. I'll use those to dip, but this is seriously the best chocolate hummus. Speaking of chocolate, I did get some mini chocolate chips. I like to have these on hand for Ninja Creamy ice cream, protein pudding. I just like the mini chocolate chips. I feel like I get more for less calories. It's probably all in my head, but I feel that way and they're my favorite. So I got those and then I picked up two more yogurts for the week because I only have three left. So I got a strawberry and a strawberry cheesecake both from Chobani Zero Sugar, which is truly my very favorite yogurt. I did find this organic Caesar salad kit on sale for $1.80. We're gonna have to eat this today because it's starting to turn, but we should be able to eat this today with some real good chicken nuggets on there for a protein packed, veggie packed lunch. So again, instead of doing a salad night for dinner, we'll do salad for lunch today. And then we will do burgers and we'll have lots of leftovers. I also got a big veggie tray for Troy. Look, $6.30 and that includes the ranch, cauliflower, celery, carrots, and broccoli. And it actually looks really good and we go through our veggie trays pretty quickly speaking of veggies produce fruit i did grab a couple of bananas i just like having bananas on hand i've been still i'm still in my banana era i'm still loving my bananas i also needed a couple of zucchinis for a recipe i did pick up some more mini cucumbers we love these for snacking and again we can dip the cucumbers in the dip in the veggie tray and then last but not least, I grabbed some baby spinach for a recipe as well as for salads, omelets, egg scrambles. I love to wilt spinach down. I even put it in my smoothies to really pack in the greens. You can't taste it, but you're getting all of the vitamins, minerals, and nutrients. I also picked up four 12 packs of Diet Coke. They're currently buy two, get two free. That makes a 12 pack only $5. So excellent price. Those are in the garage for Troy. So let's go ahead and jump into what's for dinners and what's in Monday's meal prep. So here's what's on my menu for dinners for the week. We're going to do turkey burgers one night. I'm going to have a pizza night and a salad night. We are doing that burger night like I mentioned as well. And then here's what you'll see in meal prep. Hello, Lola. <laughs> Hello. What? Oh, I know, just a minute. So here is what is in my meal prep that you'll see on Monday. I am doing a crispy potato egg an onion skillet for breakfast, a high protein chicken enchilada for lunch, and then I'm going to be making deep dish cookie pie for dessert. You'll see all three recipes in Monday's meal prep. Excuse me, tell daddy, tell him. You want a treat? Oh, is that what you need? Okay, let's go. Let's get treats. 